Hey folks, now I'm going to show you the inside of the Chevy Equinox. By opening the door, the first thing you're going to notice here is the red stitching. Also, the red insert pad inside of your handle here, giving it a sportier look. Next, you're going to notice the Pioneer, which the LTZ comes equipped with standard. Great sound system. The next thing you're going to notice on your electric 8-way power adjustable seat is it has two memory seats for driver one and driver two, making it easy and convenient for both drivers. Um, now I'm gonna take you on the inside and go over some interior features with you. First thing I like to show you is the laser cut key that Chevy has provided you with the handle, the button here to open up your electronic lift gate, as well as this button here because the LTZ is equipped with remote start. You can start your vehicle from up to 100 feet away with this button. Also, you can turn the vehicle off with this button. So we'll put it in the ignition. Let's turn it on. The first thing I want to go over is the steering wheel. The LTZ is equipped with a leather wrap steering wheel, giving you more grip and more comfortability on long trips. Also, it is adjustable by moving up and down as well as telescopic to adjust the arm length, making it more comfortable for the driver. And then you're gonna notice the easy to, easy to notice, you have your miles per hour gauge here, RPM gauge, your temperature of your vehicle, as well as your gas gauge. Now this center is called your driver information center, which is this screen here. Now you can flip through this screen with these buttons here that are located next to or at the bottom of your air conditioning buttons. So by scrolling up or down, you can change through different settings on your driver information center. So you'll see navigation, which you do get free through OnStar for six months. You'll see that you have a timer to time yourself, see how long it takes you to get from point A to point B. Your average vehicle speed, you can push the button here to set and clear things. So let's clear that out. It'll tell you your um, your best score for your average fuel economy. So you can always keep an eye on what you're averaging miles per gallon. I know everyone's conscious of fuel economy these days, so this is helping you keep up. Your average fuel economy around the city, you push the button once again to set and clear. And it's gonna bring a fuel range. We have low fuel in this vehicle right now, but if you do have a half tank, quarter tank, whichever it may be, this is gonna show you how many miles you have left in your gas tank. And now if you push this menu button here located right next to the option scroll, it's going to pull up a different screen, which is your vehicle information screen. Now this screen is going to show you different things like your oil life monitoring system. Now what this vehicle is equipped with is the oil life monitoring system, which oil filters your oil, controlling the amount of contaminants that are in it. It's going to count down from 100% down to 15% warning you when it's time for an oil change so it's easy to keep up on oil changes. It's also going to show you your tire pressure on all four tires because when you have the proper PSI you're going to maximize on fuel economy. It's also going to show you you know US or metric which we both know we leave it on US. So that's a great system there it helps you monitor your vehicle. Now on your steering wheel here you're going to notice things on your left side which are your cruise control. Regular cruise control buttons, easy to use, turn on or turn off, set, resume, or slow down your speed. Now these two buttons are the buttons you're gonna realize that only the Equinox is equipped with in this trim level, which is your front collision alert, as well as your lane departure assist. There's actually a camera located right here behind the rear view mirror facing forward. Now what that camera is going to do and the collision alert, it's going to monitor traffic in front of you. If they stomp on their brakes and you're not paying attention, it's going to alert you of that visibly up here. And it's also going to beep and alert you of that in case your eyes are off of the road. Now the lane departure warning, what that's going to do is monitor the white lines on the lane. Now if you go to veer into a different lane without your blinker on, it's also going to beep and alert you of that in case your eyes are off the road. Both safety and convenience for you and your passengers. Now on your right side, you're going to see your Bluetooth hands-free calling buttons, which are easy to use. This is how you'll answer your phone calls, hang up your phone calls. This is also your voice command. Now this vehicle 
being equipped with navigation, you can type in an address manually or via voice command, which will be this button here. Now this button is to change channels on your radio and work the volume. If you actually push this in, it's gonna change through different sources, which would be AM, FM, Pandora, Stitcher, all the different um, ones that the Chevy MyLink is available with. Now moving to the Chevy MyLink system, first of all, let's turn it on. This is a seven and a half inch touchscreen system, really intuitive and easy to use. You'll notice a source button here. You pull up and it's gonna give you all your different sources. When your compatible smartphone is programmed to it, you'll see that you also get Pandora and Stitcher Radio as an option. Your home page is always gonna bring up what is made to look like applications to make it easier for the user. It's really simple to use. You have your now plane, which is always gonna bring up your radio station, your navigation, your phone, which is really simple, easy to use. Enter phone number, is gonna pull up a keypad so you no longer have to touch your phone for anything. You can dial out from here, you can scroll through your phone book from here, look at your recent contacts, whether they're incoming or outgoing calls, very easy to use. Now next you're gonna see your different sources of music, AM, FM, XM, Pandora, and Stitcher Radio. If I hit this button here to go to the next screen, it's gonna pull up my other options, CD, USB, and auxiliary, which this Equinox comes equipped with standard, Bluetooth, as well as configuration of your sound. So you can configure treble, bass, balance, all in here. Configuration mode is gonna be how you configure your automatic headlights, your automatic locking doors. You can program it to, to automatically lock once you hit, your, hit a certain speed or as soon as you put the Equinox in drive. That's how you'll go through all those selections there. Now if I push weather with XM radio activation, it's gonna show you the weather, humidity, the wind temp, the wind um, gust miles per hour, and the city that you're currently in, and show you when it was last updated so you know it is current. Now by pushing next again, it's gonna pull me up to a screen where you see a tab for movies. Now if you have a USB flash drive and plug it into our USB port and you have a movie stored on there, you can actually watch movies on this screen as long as the vehicle's in part because we know it's illegal to be driving a vehicle while watching the screen. The next thing that's really convenient, if you find yourself in an area you're unfamiliar with, you need gas, simply press the fuel button. It's gonna pull up all the gas stations that are in your area. It's gonna tell you the distance from you and even what they're selling their gas for per gallon. To make it really simple, when you do have navigation, all you do is select the one you'd like, hit start guidance, and your navigation is gonna give you turn-by-turn -turn directions to that gas station. You're also gonna see a tab that says pictures. Now if you store pictures on a USB thumb drive and plug it into the port, you can also flip through different pictures on this screen here. Remember home is always gonna take us there. Go to now playing to get back to your radio station. Very simple and intuitive. Now all those buttons there when you see back and home, they're actually right here for you also. So if you don't want to touch your screen, maybe you don't want to put any fingerprints on it, you can use these buttons right here to make it just as easy and convenient. Now the next thing you're going to notice is um, the child safety lock on the Equinox is electronic. You know, No more turning the latch in the door handle, in the door anymore. All you do is push this button here, it's going to activate child safety lock so now your kids cannot open the vehicle from the inside. You also have another button here to lock and unlock your doors, making it a little more convenient for you when you put your vehicle in park to simply reach up and lock or unlock your doors. Now moving down, you're gonna see first of all, these are leather appointed heated seats. By pushing this button here, you'll notice they turn on high. Pushing it again takes it to medium, then takes it to low, then shutting them completely off. Now next you're gonna notice is your AC, which is still really basic and easy to use. Um, this will be your front defroster, rear defroster, and actually has rear outside defrosters, which are electronic and automatic. So they'll turn up to temperature and you know, get away frost or any residuals, um, contaminants, or anything that's on the mirror. And right here, you'll notice on the Equinox, they actually kind of hid where you put your CD in. 
Um, this will be illuminated with Chevy's blue ice color at night, making it easier for you to see. Now moving up to the mirror, you're gonna notice your OnStar buttons, which is a feature only offered through Chevy. Um, OnStar is great for turn-by-turn -turn navigation, roadside assistance, also to with your SOS button here, you can call out for help, whether it be paramedics, police, any type of emergency help you or an innocent bystander needs. By pushing the OnStar button, you can route your turn-by-turn -turn navigation, also have them lock or unlock your vehicle. With this button here, you can actually make phone calls. Now, unlike regular cell phone services, this is ran by satellite, not antenna. So you have service where cell phones don't. God forbid you ever run out of gas, get a flat tire in an area you don't have cell phone service, you can push this button and dial out to anyone you'd like. Um, moving up here, you're going to see that in the LTZ, is going to come standard with remote link, making it easy for you to program your garage door opener so you no longer have to have it clipped to your sun visor here. Now these are going to be your dome lights here, turning your dome lights on and off. And this button, this here, is to adjust your automatic lift gate. Now, like I said earlier, you can adjust it to open three quarters all of the way or actually customize how far it opens depending on the height of your garage door. The inside of the Chevy Equinox is made to be convenient, giving you four 12 volt um, power outlets. It's actually equipped with eight cup holders and the cargo storage that's hidden underneath your armrest here is actually designed to hold a laptop. So made for comfort and convenience, keep you intuitive and in touch with all of the new features. Um, one thing you're also going to notice on the Chevy Equinox is the button here, which is going to um, allow your traction control, um, stability track, which is going to keep you on the road and safe. Another thing you'll notice when you look here is there's an M. The M is for manual mode. You'll also see a positive and negative button here. When you put it in manual mode, it's going to allow you to shift the transmission however you would like. If you're up a, going upgrade, down a grade, or simply to pass a semi on the road. Now this vehicle is equipped standard with six airbags and actually has a sensor that detects impact. So it only is going to deploy which airbags are needed upon impact. That's going to conclude our walk around the 2014 Chevy Equinox. For any further questions, test drives, come see John Martinez at Tom Bell Chevrolet in Redlands, California.